Manchester United predicted lineup versus Crystal Palace, Premier League. Manchester United play their last game of the season against Crystal Palace on Sunday afternoon after a 15-day hiatus. Ralph Rangnick and co. have had more than two weeks to mull over arguably their most embarrassing defeat of the campaign. Although, the 4-0 loss to Brighton has plenty of competition for that undignified honour. Here's the lineup Rangnick may deploy to end a dire season with a final flourish. David de G. G. K. If Manchester United's ever-present shots topper is turned to once again, he will have appeared in every minute of three of the last four Premier League seasons. Diogo Dalot, RB, the Portuguese fullback was overlooked for more than half of Ole Gunnar Solskjaer's matches in charge this season, but has been repeatedly called upon by Rangnick. Victor Lindelof, CB, Iceman has been deployed ahead of club captain Harry Maguire during the season's closing stages. Rafael Varane, CB, for the first time since he was a 17 year old at Lens, Varane is set to finish the season outside the division's top three. Alex tells, LB, with Luke Shaw returning to train. Tells once again has some competition for the left back spot. Scott McTominay, CM, this season alone, McTominay has amassed as many yellow cards, nine, as he racked up across his first 90 Premier League appearances. Nemanja Matic, CM, despite revealing his intention to leave the club this summer, Matic has started Manchester United's last five matches of the season. Bruno Fernandes, M, no outfield player has been selected more often by Rangnick since he replaced Solskjaer in December. Anthony Alanka, RW, hoisted aloft as an example and as a role model by his gushing manager, Rangnick's hefty praise for Alanka does also serve as a vehicle to criticize the squad's senior players. Cristiano Ronaldo, St. Manchester United's leading scorer is set to make his first trip to Selhurst Park since March 2005 when he came on for Quinton Fortune in the second half. Marcus Rashford, LW, after recovering from a bout of bronchitis, Rashford may have earned his first away start since the beginning of April with Jadon Sancho only just from a spell of tonsillitis himself.